The Giraffe on the Farm by Iza Wozachowska, illustrated by Gus Kim. Petey the pig, Claire the cow, and Gordy the goose lived on a farm together. They were best friends, and they played together every day. They liked to race or play games like catch and hide and seek. One day, a new animal came to the farm, but he was very different from anyone Petey, Claire, or Gordy had ever seen. Who are you? Gordy hissed at him. My name is George, the new animal said. I'm a giraffe. I was told that I'm going to live on this farm now. But the other animals didn't like George because he was funny looking, and because he didn't understand their games. Do you want to race, George? Petey asked him once, and George agreed. When Petey said, "On your mark, get set, go," everyone ran across the farmyard. But George had long, thin legs, and slipped in the mud and fell. He can't even race," Petey said, and Claire and Gordy laughed. "Do you want to play hide and seek, George?" Claire asked him the next day, and George agreed. Claire counted: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, ready or not, here I come. Petey and Gordy were nowhere to be found, but George had tried to hide behind a bush. But George was so tall that he was too easy to spot, and he lost the game. He can't even hide, Claire said, and the other animals laughed. George was sad that the other animals didn't want to be his friend. He liked them, and he thought he could learn to play their games if they gave him a chance. The next day, Petey, Claire, and Gordy were playing catch, but they didn't invite George. He probably can't even catch, Gordy said, and everyone laughed. Everyone but George, who sat by himself. And watched. Oh no! Petey suddenly yelled. He had thrown the ball too hard, and it landed on the roof of the barn. Now what are we going to do? Claire tried to jump, but she couldn't jump high enough to reach the ball. Petey tried to throw Gordy toward the ball, but that didn't work either. Maybe I can help," George said from behind the fence. "I'm tall enough to reach the roof." The other animals agreed to let him help, and George returned their ball. "Thanks, George," they said. "You're good at that. Maybe you're not the best hider or racer, but you can learn to do those things. Do you want to play catch with us?" And George agreed, and all the animals became friends.